The Park Rapids baseball team survived a big time scare yesterday in the first round of the Section 8 2 way tournament. The Panthers knocked off Northern Freeze 6 to 5 on a walk off squeeze play. The win extended the Park Rapids winning streak to 14 games, the school's longest streak in more than 10 years. The Panthers aren't afraid to swing the bats, and that philosophy has worked wonders this season. Meet one of the most aggressive hitting teams you'll ever see. They're taught to hit the first good fastball. They hit the first good pitch in the count because they might not get another one. We don't want to get down and behind in the count. Uh, we want to stay aggressive. That approach has worked. There's not one easy out on the Park Rapids baseball team. And that's because this club really enjoys the chance to hit. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Big fan of hitting, yeah. <laughs> I, love, I love hitting. It's the best part about the game. We uh, kind of feed off of each other. One person's hitting well, everyone else. It's kind of a contagious thing. Everyone starts hitting the ball together. In a day where some offensive philosophies make it seem like the hitter doesn't even want to be in the batter's box, it's refreshing to see a team like the Panthers hack away. If you're gonna, if you're gonna be up there and be a hitter, uh, that's why I don't, I don't, I never call a kid a batter. They're always hitters because they don't go up there to take an at bat. They're up there to attack a pitch, and that's how we uh, score runs, and that's how we've been winning games. Along with good pitching and good defense, I mean, it's a tough, tough recipe to beat. It's been 14 games since anybody has figured out how to beat Park Rapids. That winning streak is great, but after yesterday's close victory, the Panthers know that getting wins from here on out takes a lot more than just showing up. Last game, I mean, it was a close one-run game, and uh, it kind of brought us back to reality as a team, and I think we realize what we need to do now every single game. Yesterday, um, you know, a really, t a really close call, uh, got down early, really had to be mentally strong and battle back, and I think that was the key uh, to see some of our senior leaders to really pick it up. I think we got a lot of our jitters out in that game, so it's time to stop surviving and start thriving. The Panthers are averaging 9.9 .9 runs per game, which is the third most in Class 2A. Park Rapids plays Rozo tomorrow in the Section 8 2A tournament. Right now it's a double elimination, so even if that winning streak comes to an end, the Panthers will still be alive. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.